Uh, what started at, uh, we're talking about the pumpkin, uh, the jack-o'-lantern spectacular, and it really started as an effort uh, of like social distancing and keeping people away from one another when it was necessary, but now it's turned into this staple yeah. that has to happen every fall. When I moved here, it was definitely something I had heard of. I haven't made it out yet, but I'm very excited as we've been looking at it all today because the Jack-O-Lantern Spectacular is back at Iroquois Park today. So Jim is there live this morning. Jim, have you found a favorite pumpkin yet? I think I have, Grayson. It's the one right behind me. I think a lot of people are going to find this one their favorite. This is the laughing tree right behind me. Lots of pumpkins here. And when it's in its full glory, it is going to be something to see when you come out to Iroquois Park. Uh, I'm joined by Brooke now, Brooke from the Parks Alliance. Brooke, the laughing tree just it is so magical to see so many pumpkins out here all kind of coordinated together. It looks amazing. Well, I love the fact, too, you could stand here and look at it forever and mm -hmm. see every pumpkin has its own little facial expression, yes. its own, like, crazy look. It's, <laughs> you know, they're, they are not cookie-cutter pumpkins. They're, every one of them is different. Yes, of course. And this is obviously the 11th year for Jack-O-Lantern mm -hmm. Spectacular. It's such an amazing event being out here in, the, in Iroquois Park. What's it like to you to be able to say that this is back for another year? Well, I tell you what, this event supports the Parks Alliance of Louisville and more than a hundred of our public parks. So it is not only an amazing evening with the family, um, an incredible experience in the beautiful woods at Iroquois Park, but you can feel good knowing that you're also investing in more than a hundred of our public parks when you attend the event. So quickly, let's talk just very briefly about how long the event is open for, mm -hmm. days people can come out, what do they need to know? So we are open um, until 10 o'clock, Sunday through Thursday, until 11 o'clock on Friday and Saturday. Um, we are open through Halloween, so October 31st will be our last night. Of course, we're opening tonight, yes. October 3rd. Um, and I, I would say that the, the, the tip for folks who live in Louisville is come on a Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday night. Those mm -hmm. tend to be our slower nights. Um, we have a lot of people that travel from all over the country to come to this event, so they're typically here on the weekends. It's a very popular event, and you can see exactly why. We've had a great time out here at uh, Jack Lantern Spectacular. Eric Grace, toss it back to you for now. I'm going to just take in a couple more of these pumpkins as we make our way out here. In it's a crazy bit. impressive. It really is. I it's did wild. you see any pumpkins with our faces? I mean, there's always news people out there that have their own pumpkins. I've never seen Grace's face on a pumpkin and my head is shaped like a pumpkin. I figured I'd be a great. <laughs> I don't know. My head would fit on a pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> Jim, we'll leave you to check that out. See if you can find pictures <laughs> of us. We'll come